Here with No Limit, e, Ethan Anderson of Fairfax. Ethan, you were committed to UNLV. Coach Menzies sadly gets fired. You reopen your recruitment, now going to USC. When you first heard the news about Coach Menzies getting fired, what went through your head and how tough was that for you? Well, when I found out Coach Menzies got fired, I was actually at Fairfax on my way home, and uh, Coach Menzies gave me a call. I actually saw it first on Bleacher Report, but when he gave me the call, I couldn't believe it was true. And then he, he gave me the green light to go ahead and reopen my recruitment. And the way they fired him, it was so unexpected. Like he, the athletic director would tell him all the time that she loved him and all that. So and this is the business that we're in. So I have to prepare for that. So luckily, I was able to have a good senior season, be able to have schools call and still want me at this late, how late it is in the game. So you see how many unsigned seniors there is. So I'm blessed to be having this opportunity. You opened up the recruitment, and USC obviously got involved. That's where you're going to end up. But what was it like for you? You tweeted out, I'm no longer with UNLV. Who reached out? How did that all go down? Well, a few schools reached out. USC, Providence, Utah, Hawaii. Uh, yeah, I think that was about it. And USC, they just, it was, I passed by there every time I go to Fairfax on my way there. So it's always been a dream school of mine. And when I went down there to a visit, and they were just saying all the right things, telling me they're going to develop me, and how they need my athleticism, my, my IQ, my unselfishness, and being a competitor. They need to win this next season, they said, so I was all in. You got an incredible recruiting class, and they've added you, talking about Isaiah Mobley, the big O, Drake London. What's it mean to you to go into a really high-level Division One program with a lot of these really top-level guys you've grown up playing with? Yeah, well, I'm growing up playing with and against all these guys, and like you said, Isaiah Mobley's a McDonald's All-American, Big O should have been, but all of got Drake London, Max, Max I played with all summer in ninth to 12th grade, so it was a great spot for me. I feel like I can, those guys can make me better, and I can also make them look better also. So I'm really looking forward to playing with them. I haven't played with dominant base like that before in my life, so I'm really looking forward to that. The coaching staff, Jason Hart, he's a point guard in the NBA, so I feel like I can learn a lot from them. Coach Enfield was a great guy, so it was just the right program for me. And Ethan, last thing for you, all-star game tonight here at St. John Bosco, put on by Beach City Hoops. How excited are you to play in the premier game tonight against some guys you're going to be playing with next year and just some of the best guys in Southern California? Must be really excited for you to cap off your senior year in this way. Yeah, well, definitely. I was able to, I'm going to be able to put on his jersey again. Fair I thought this was going to be the last time we lost. But like you said, I'll be playing with Big O. So I was looking forward to getting used to playing with him and just a whole lot of talent in the gym. So we're going to have fun tonight. That'll be a little preview for USC fans. He's Ethan Anderson, a city champ. Ethan, thank you so much, and good luck with the Trojans, man. We're all looking forward to seeing how you do. Thank you. Appreciate it.